first I'd like to say welcome to everyone to the town hall. Really pleased to see everyone and a great turnout. The Freeman Award is the highest tribute that the borough can bestow. And while whilst in modern times it's only a, a ceremonial honour, freedmen, uh, freedmen are invited to take part in all important civic events in the borough. Uh, the first freedman uh, in Tamworth was granted in 1951 and following your presentation you'll be one of 16 people to um, to have the title bestowed upon them you know I mean, three of them tonight's great um, I have a full list of all your rights and privileges granted um, which is right here and you'll be presented that um, it includes to enjoy the cur the courtesy title freedman and uh, to be addressed to have their names entered on the board con um, containing their names in the honorary freedmen of the borough to be placed in the corridor of the council chamber and traditionally the freedmen can enjoy special rights and in Tamworth's case it's including the right of pasture in the ca castle grounds a bit, of a, a bit of a strange one but yeah you know i look forward to seeing you all do that um, so now we move forward to the formal part of the ceremony we, we will present you with the award to each of you in turn and the nominators um, and the nominators would also like to say a few words. I will now hand over to the Chief Executive, Stephen Gabriel. Good evening, everybody. Uh, at a special meeting of Tamworth Borough Council held on Tuesday, the 16th of July, 2019, it was resolved that pursuant to section 249, section five of the Local Government Act, 1972, this council does, by, does hereby confer the title of Honorary Freeman of the Borough upon David Gilbert in recognition for being an inspiration to other Tamworth residents during the year of 2019. I would like to wish you congratulations on receiving this award and ask you and ask the Mayor, Councillor Gareth Gold, to present you with the award. Um, I will ask Mr. Uh, Danny Cook, who nominated Dave, if you'd like to say a few words. Ooh, 2019, it's been a while, hasn't it? Uh, so, yeah, Mr. Dave Gilbert, so I nominated for uh, Freedom of the Borough in 2019. Otherwise known here as the Angry Farmer, I'm led to believe. Uh, obviously, we're all aware, Dave was born in Donisthorpe, but was raised in Tamworth, and regularly went on sponsor and calls himself a proud Tammy. Uh, former World Snooker Young Player of Destination, I had to look that up. <laughs> uh, obviously, we recall 2019, uh, I was leader of Town for a council at the time. Um, some exciting things were taking place at Town for yeah. council. We were reviewing taxi licences, debating more IT training for councillors, and mostly, Town was offered in how to remove earwaxes. The big things on the agenda. While at the same time, as many as you know, I play a lot of snooker, pool, football. And at the, time, at the time, in Tamworth, in the middle of 2019, the talk of football pitches, the talk of the club, the club's two clubs, was David Gilbert. He inspired Tamworth for a little bit of that late sort of spring, early summer. And he was the talk of everything as he made his way to the World Championship semi-final. And he was the talk of Tamworth. Narrowly losing in the semi-final to Mr John Higgins, who was the four-time world champion. That young lad from Tamworth flying the flag, constantly in his news, saying he's proud of it from Tamworth. We wanted to present Mr Gilbert with his award in 2019. But tragically, had he got to the World Championship semi-final and got to the top ten in the world, China kept inviting him to tournaments, so we couldn't get him in the building. Towards the end of 2019, he finally arrived back in the UK and COVID kicked off. Now, I don't want to make any accusations here. <laughs> but I think Dave is very, very worthy of this award. He did inspire Tamworth. He's continued to inspire Tamworth. He's again been to the World Championship semi-final. And he's, since that time, won, a, I believe, a ranking tournament as well. Proud Tamworth, we should be proud of our sports stars and those that are selling Tamworth, and Mr Gilbert is one of those. It was my pleasure to nominate him in 2019, and I'm just pleased we've finally got it into your hands. No, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Now I'm going to invite you, Dave, if you want to say a few. I won't bore you for too long, but um, yeah, a big thanks to Danny for the award. It's been, it's been a while, and... Uh, I bet you, you got in touch with me after the World Semi again this year and uh, it's an award I always wanted. I am a proud Tammy. I wasn't born here, but I absolutely call myself a Tammy. And uh, 
Yeah, just thanks a lot. I'm, I'm very proud, proud of that. And it's in, we've just got a new club, the Potter's Kiss now in the town, which was something we've always wanted to do, have a, a business in the area and get the young kids playing. So that's going to go on the wall in there. And uh, thank you very much. Thank you. Okay, at a meeting of Tamworth Borough Council held on Tuesday the 21st of May 2024, it, will, it was resolved that pursuant to section 249, section 5 of the Local Government Act 1972, this council does hereby confer the title of Honorary Freeman of the Borough upon George and Louise Greenaway in recognition of services to Tamworth's economy and tourism. I'd like, to wish, I'd like to wish you congratulations on receiving this award and ask the Mayor, Councillor Gareth of Coles, to present the award to you. I don't know how to, what do you like to do? <laughs> do, you want, do you want to come this side? You, you, you sure? Okay. I would like to invite Councillor Tina Clements to come up and say a few words, please. There's one of you know, that you can sit there now. <laughs> um, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to this wonderful town hall we've got here in Tamworth. Um, as we know, um, George has run the Tamworth Tap with his team tap that some of them are here this evening um, for a number of years and has won um, Camera Pub of the Year twice now, two years running. The Tamworth Tap is truly one of the, uh, the best pubs in the country and people come from all over the world to visit the Tamworth Tap um, and sample the real ale. The building started off, um, well, I think you can say needing a little TLC, wasn't it, George? Um, and George painstakingly returned the building to its former glory in a heritage-sensitive area of our beautiful town. George is Tamworth through and through and always uh, has always seen the town taking to and, and advising other local businesses, business owners. He really is a true champion of Tamworth. George and others have also been instrumental in the twin association um, with our friends in Bad Lassler and Bajors and has made friends for life. I just want to say, when we did the St Paul Council, the award was just for George, um, but we had a debate about it and we, we realised that behind every good man there's an even better woman. It's so the team, <laughs> the team is George and Louise, they can't be separated. Um, so just, just a few words about Louise. I've seen your passion for your in, um, for the next generation in your career in teaching. And I've also seen the way you are with your nieces and nephews, especially yeah. them pesky twins, girls, wherever they're sat. Um, the things you do with them, the Facebook posts you put on. So it's not just about George, it is about Louise as well. You are a team and we're so proud to have you as, as, as Tom of Westbrook. Thank you. I, I will now invite George and Louise to say a few words. If you just hold the microphone. At least it's not a retort. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, I've just got to start by saying how proud I am to be from Tamworth. Um, everything that we've done at the tap has been about celebrating the town. It could have been George's Brewery or George and Louise's Brewery, or, but Tamworth's that important to me that we have to champion it. From following Tamworth Football Club all over the country to brewing the first Tamworth beer since 1948, I think it was. Um, I could not have done that without the huge, massive um, partnership that we have, Louise and I have, um, and, um, and she knows now as well. I'm getting boring with uh, just talking about the pub all yeah. the time. So she drags me off um, just for a few days convalescence and just get us away from the pub. Um, but yeah, it, it is, it's, it's in our forethoughts. Uh, the, the moment we wake up to the, the moment we go to sleep, just how we can really champion the town and, uh, and celebrate the town. And, and it's a real honour and privilege. And, and looking back to when I was a, a kid, looking on at the pomp and ceremony of the town and the town hall and all the mayors and uh, um, mayors' processions and all that type of stuff and carnivals, you know, it's, it's quite humbling and uh, an honour to be stood here today receiving this award. So thanks very much. Thank you very much. And here's a copy of both. No worries, you get one each. Thank you. 
At the meeting of Tamworth Borough Council held on Tuesday the 9th of July 2024, it was resolved that pursuant to section 249, section 5 of the Local Government Act 1972, this council does hereby confer the title of Honorary Freeman of the Borough upon Ben Newman, otherwise known as Spudman, in recognition for his services to Tamworth's economy and tourism. I would like to wish you congratulations on receiving this award and actually being someone that's taking one of your spots. Um, and ask the Mayor, Councillor Gareth Ars, to present you with the award. <laughs> I'm going to invite. Is it Tina again? Yeah, yeah. I'm going to invite Tina up again. I thought you went back up there. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Tina, Clements. Speech as well. Are you going to talk? You can read it all. No, no, carry on. Um, ben, the son of a potato farmer, um, started his, business, his jacket potato business here in Tamworth in 2003. So 21 years ago. My maths is right, yeah. Yeah, yeah. A long time. Um, happy with what he'd got, uh, was now faced, like George, with a world pandemic and a growing family. For those of you that don't know, Ben's got nine kids. I don't, I don't think the telly worked in their house at all. I couldn't afford the TV license or something, but there we are. Um, so he, de he decided to embrace new technology, as we all know, he's now on TikTok. Which was, was he around 21 years ago? No, oh God, no. No. no, so TikTok, if anybody wants to know what he's up to, get on TikTok. Yeah. It's, it's, it's a young thing, that's why I'm not on it. Uh, where am I? So, um, he's found a, a very innovative brand for his business to raise awareness and promote not only his business, but ultimately Tamworth. People from around the world, and we do mean around the world, don't we? They've come from Japan and uh, daily, daily world visitors. Um, <laughs> People from around the world now look into the world of Spudman as he works from his trailer uh, on Tamworth's Market Square. As the, so as the social media uh, reach group, I think he's got now over 3 million TikTok followers. Yeah, pretty Yeah, I've only got about 1,000 followers, so I've got no chance. Yeah. <laughs> uh, no one is more surprised at his successes than Ben himself. And for those of you that didn't know, Ben was at the Spirit of Tamworth Awards on Saturday, weren't you, Ben? And he thought he was in the category of business in the community. Oh, disqualified. And he got disqualified because everyone thought it's not fair that Ben's in that category. Ben needs his own category. And Ben was awarded the Inspiring Tamworth Award, which will now become a category every year, thanks to, thanks to you, Ben. So that's another trophy we've got to pay out for. Perhaps you could sponsor it. Maybe. Yeah, that's <laughs> so as I said with uh, with George, behind every every good man, there's an even better woman pushing and driving. And I got to meet your wife on Saturday, and apart from her politics, she's a lovely lady. But <laughs> we won't go into that tonight. That wasn't your wife. Oh, there we are. That was somebody else that just dropped some well. right in it. Yeah, that wasn't my wife. <laughs> um, anyway, boys <laughs> <in> the bat. <laughs> Awkward. Um, so. Uh, well done, Ben. It, 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 we're so proud to have you here in Tamworth, along with George and Louise and the other businesses that you promote. So thank you very much for being here. There you go, Ben, if you'd like to say a few words. Sorry, Ben. I'm going to keep this short and sweet. Yeah, I know, I know. Oh. <laughs> Bye, Saturday. It's been an absolutely insane year. It was about this time last year when we started to go crazy on social media and bring Tamworth to the world and it has done and yeah I just love this place and we're going to carry on shouting about it and bringing things to Tamworth and bringing lots of people to Tamworth and hopefully just keep this town rolling forward like with these guys so thank you very much cheers man thank you cheers man thank you and this is uh, all the, the Friedman honour that you guys awesome. thank yeah, you So I'd like to thank everyone uh, for attending and to invite everyone for refreshments in the Mayor's Parlour just behind us. So thank you very much.